uh, for Melinda that she got her start as a dancer and a Baba lover in New York studying ballet with Peter Saul, Margaret Prask, and Tex Hightower. She toured the U.S. with the New York Theater Ballet and danced at the Mayor Center for the 30th anniversary celebration of Mayor Baba's visit there. And recently she received a Fulbright to study dance anthropology, which she spent researching circle dancing at the Meher Baba Center in London. <laughs> and John Selfridge, known to family, friends, and the Baba community as Duke, first heard of Meher Baba in the spring of 1969 at the age of 12, thanks to Harold, Virginia, and Raphael Rudd. And I want to hear more about this. He and Melinda have been making music together since they first met for Indian food in Greenwich Village in 1989 on a blind date in a hurricane. <laughs> they were married in 1994 and now live in Western Massachusetts. And we are very fortunate and grateful to have them here tonight for concert, for our Thursday night concert lineup. And I do want to hear more about that hurricane date, but you know, you Hurricane could... Hugo it was, Ruth. <laughs> so there you were, having having Indian food together. That's right. right. All right, so um, I'll just say a couple of things first uh, before we start playing. Um, uh, we're going to work in a number of different instruments into the evening, um, and that made the sound check a, a little tricky when we worked with Joe, but we think we've got it down, so... Uh, everything can be heard just right, but we can always tweak as we go. If you guys feel like, oh, you're not hearing this or that, uh, just give us, you know, give us a signal of some kind. <laughs> thumbs down, thumbs up, whatever. Um, and uh, we'll probably not introduce every song that we do. Maybe we'll play a song and then talk about it later, that sort of thing. But we've got a lot to say as well as a lot to play. <laughs> so, uh, so here we go. Jay Baba. So yeah, Jay Baba. This is. Baba's favorite song we thought we'd start out with. Welcome to my world Won't you come on in
Welcome to my world With my arms unfurled Waiting just for you Welcome to my world Che Baba Che Baba <laughs> So how did the how did the sound balance work? Is everything good? Joe, what do you think? I think it sounded great. Are the vocals coming through loudly loud enough? We got a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Excellent. Yeah. Great. All right. All right. So um, the next tune is going to be familiar to you guys, I'm sure. Um, when I first heard the song, um, I was a little kid when the Beatles' first album came out. It's on the uh, very first album by the Beatles called Meet the Beatles. And right then and there, even though we're talking about 1963, I just knew that someday I would be zooming on Baba Zoom and playing this song via stream. And so what do you know? Here I am doing it. Can you believe that? Was that like really bad? Yeah. <laughs> That's perfect pattern. All right, that here we go. Makes okay. happy. Makes it happy. There were bells on the hill. We have a, an old classic, Cindy Lowe's Pilgrim's Arty. Except my 
Baba. I had to repeat my favorite verse. I think Baba had a message for me that I should leave everything to his perfect plan. <laughs> okay. Oh, now we have... This is a, an original song that I played. Um, I, was, I was fortunate to play at Baba's 100th birthday party at Mayor Baba House in New York City, which was in the old studio where we danced um, with Miss Krask. So that was really an exciting moment. And um, these are uh, Baba's words from Mayor Baba's call. Um, I've taken a little poetic license with them. There is one line that is not Baba's line. See if you can pick it out. And afterwards, there'll be a quiz, and we'll put it in the chat. But Steve, you're disqualified because you already know the answer to the. Steve's always disqualified. <laughs> he's, got, he's disqualified. OK. Um, and let's see. Um, I'll just read this text from um, Mayor Baba the Awakener. This is Baba's words. Only those who can lose themselves in my love will find themselves in me. This is not idle talk, but an authoritative statement that eternally I have been and will be always the slave of my lovers. So this is called Slave of My Lover's Love. going to be an instrument change, another instrument yes, change, another. <laughs> and um, you can just throw your line that you think On the was chat. the line that wasn't Baba's into the chat, and then prizes will be distributed afterwards. I'm not seeing anything. Maybe, Steve, maybe you'll have to join <laughs> after all. <laughs> 
I'm not seeing answers flying in. <laughs> We've forgotten the words. <laughs> right. There's a hint. There was one of the most one of the one of the the latest lines at the end. <laughs> no. The one that the one that. Um, <clears throat> That is not Baba's is turn your back on heaven and find me. And that turns out it's from uh, Emerson, Ralph Waldo Emerson's poem, Brahman. And uh, this was a sentiment that um, Miss Krask would talk about. She, she really loved that idea that, um, that even if Baba wasn't who he said he was, he was just, he was just so full of love that it would have been the same for her uh, whether or not it was all true. She would say, if somebody came and told me that none of it was true, I would still be there. I would still do it all over again. So I always love that sentiment. Ready? I'm ready. Okay. All right. I'll see you in a little bit. This is my, uh, my solo spot. Hi, everybody. I just want to say a couple of things about um, my piano playing. I've been playing since I was uh, about five years old, but... Um, never really got any training, so I, I really do and always have played by ear. I mean, I had piano lessons for about like five minutes, you know, uh, when I was a kid. And um, I really hated the lessons, but I liked playing. So I just played all the time, um, played what I heard, you know. Um, and so the result is what I, I like to say that what I do is I improvise on borrowed themes. So maybe some of the things I'll play for you will sound vaguely familiar, but then I always sort of segue into something that will definitely be familiar to you. So the patient among you are rewarded if you w hang in there and wait for something familiar. Right? I, I promise I will deliver. Okay? All right. <clears throat>
white shots fell like rain from on high. The laugh from his eyes floated rivers unending into the sands where the spring of our hearts had run dry. The song is, um, now I'm going to talk about the uh, Willow song first. The, the song is uh, uh, familiar to some of you, I hope. I'm thinking it would be uh, familiar. Um, it's Willow song. Um, I lead into it, though, with uh, a kind of, as I said, a, a borrowed theme. It's borrowed from uh, Keith Jarrett, a song called My Song. Um, but uh, Willow song um, is uh, credited to Raphael Rudd, my old friend. Um, it's on his uh, CD called um, Chronicles. So it might be familiar to you. I've, I've also seen it used as a soundtrack to uh, some footage of Baba from, I think, the 30s. Um, in any case, um, on Chronicles, the CD, uh, Raph is credited, um, but also Ward Parks is. And I'm not sure um, exactly who wrote what. Um, I'm thinking that my guess is that Raph probably wrote the music. And I've heard him, I heard him play it many times, uh, you know, uh, just on piano. I heard him. So he's, you know, it's his, it's his music probably, and maybe Ward Parks contributed the lyrics. I'm not sure. Um, the lyrics don't sound like something Raph would write, actually. So that's my guess, anyway. But if anybody knows the answer to that, there's that's what the chat is for, right? Um, and uh, so I'm going to play one more on uh, on piano, a short piece, uh, before we move to uh, get Melinda and drag her back in, All right? Thank you. 
American RT. Okay, Melinda, you can come back now. Well, that was a surprise. What? The singing. Oh, Yay. I didn't sing at all in rehearsals. He wouldn't. He wouldn't. He wouldn't confess that he was going to sing, but I love his singing. Oh, here you can have your music. Okay. Okay, thank you. All right. So I'm here. We're gonna. We'll have a short break after this, but I. Um, this is another original tune, and I call it Peter's Song, um, after Peter Saul, who was my ballet teacher, and he was my first Baba contact. Um, he was my ballet teacher at, at Cornell University. I was an undergrad there. And um, let's see, he introduced me to Miss Krask, and I later went on to study with Miss Krask. And then about 10 years later, Peter called and he said, can you come and teach for me? He was very ill. And so I went up and taught for him, and he did pass away while I was there. And he was living, I was living in his apartment, and I came upon um, a book of Rumi's poems, um, Coleman Bark's interpretation, and uh, this one is The Diver's Clothes. He had it bookmarked, and so I read it, and I thought, oh, this was his experience of being with Baba, and it just captured it so beautifully, and he had been, um, at the center in 1958 and carried Baba in his chair and was also at the, at the, at the beach when they were looking for the perfect shells. So um, that's the story behind this one. And there is, this is loosely, this is um, some poetic license on Rumi's words or Coleman Barks' interpretation of Rumi's words. And there is one line of Baba, which I'm sure you'll all be able to recognize. You're sitting here with us, but you're also out walking in a field at dawn. You're yourself the animal we hunt. When you're with us on the hunt, you're solid in your body, like a plant in the ground. Yet you're wind. You're the diver's clothes, lying empty on beach. You are fish in the ocean. Are many bright, bright strands and many dark strands like veins that are seen when a break. <laughs> Any kind of watering that you would like to do. You might water your plants, you might water yourself, you might go to the water closet, 
And um, we're just thinking a, a few minutes, like five minutes. How's that? Sounds great. <laughs> Stretch. <laughs> yeah. All right. Everybody out, huh? Okay. Guess I like those stories about Margaret Crass. Yeah, right? Oh, yeah. Thank you for putting that in there because, oh, I, I can't believe you both danced with her and, and now you're doing this singing. <laughs> and now I'm doing the singing. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of a surprise to me too. <laughs> yeah, Miss Crass beautiful. would have gotten a, a hoot. <laughs> the the two of you together, it's really beautiful and very peaceful. It's really yeah. lovely. Good, good. It's a yeah. nice, nice evening thing. Yes, um, I did when I played. Um, I played this song and the the slave of my lover's love song for Baba's 100th birthday at, um, at the Mayor Baba house. And Tex Hightower was there. Oh, um, wow. <laughs> and he didn't say anything <laughs> afterwards. Like, I didn't know you could sing or play the guitar. But, <laughs> but that was kind of typical, so. <laughs> but that's so nice that you can both sing and dance. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, and play the ukulele. And play the ukulele. <laughs> and play the ukulele. Right, right, right. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to, you know, like a strap would be fun so that I could play. And yeah. <laughs> because I like to do the circle dances with um, Katie Lawton and I um, like to do the circle dances and, and sing. With what are them. circle dances? Circle dances are dances done in a circle, but we've started to um, make Baba, Baba dances. Oh, how great. <laughs> Yeah. So are yeah. you still, you're not in New York right now though, right? No, we're in Western Mass now. Oh. For the last, like what, 20, 20, 20 years. years. <laughs> we moved Is that close to Boston? No, Boston would be on the Eastern side of the state. Right, it's about two and a half hours. Yeah, we're like right in between Boston and Bill Cliff. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're in between, we're in between um, Springfield, New Hampshire, and, and Albany, New York, which is Bill Cliff and, uh -huh. and Duck and Steve. As a Steve. diagonal, yes. Yeah. And who, who's the other one? Uh, yeah. Duck and Steve. <laughs> oh, are you by Chicopee? Yes, near Chicopee, that's right. Oh, that's, that's where my Baba contact lives. Oh, oh really? really? Yeah, I guess she, she never came to, I mean, she didn't come to Baba, but it's just like, uh, uh, she's just who cannot be grateful. I mean, Baba could have come through a can of tuna because of who he is, you know. But he, he came, he came through her. She gave me that "Don't worry, be happy" card, you know. Ooh. I never read, I never read it beyond "Don't worry, be happy." I thought, wow, wow, <laughs> yeah, I love it, I love it, yeah. Okay, oh, we're going to do, uh, are you ready to do? Sure, I'm ready, whatever's okay, next. Are, are you back from watering? Yeah. <laughs> we didn't leave, we're waiting. Okay. All right. Here's the news. It's so, actually raining and we're very wet. Sorry. It's actually raining in California, please don't faint, but it's raining and we got very wet while we went out and got wet. Oh, good. So it's really watering. <laughs> That's great. Really watering. Thank you. The next song is um, His Lady is, is another original called His Ladies Are. And I give you this card. I brought some cards to just have images. Sometimes I like to hold the images in my, in my mind while I play and sing. Um, this one is, um, was written around the same time as the others. Um, and let me get my music out here. Um, this and I realized that this time when I wrote a lot of these tunes was right after Miss Krask and Peter had both died. They died within a year of each other in the early 90s. And um, I had met Duke and we were living in New York um, and started learning the guitar and, and singing some of these songs. <laughs> and I was a young woman identifying person and um, these were the women around Baba that were important to me. Um, I had met two of them, um, Kitty and Miss Krask at this point, and um, Virginia Rudd was the other one that I met through Duke, and we used to go down to um, the center, and the Rudds would have us over, and we would have these fabulous meals with them, and they would just regale us with their stories of Baba, and their garlic pizza, <laughs> and <laughs> all that stuff. 
Um, and so, so we have, so Virginia has slipped into the pantheon of the other, other women. Um, and the other thing to, that I wanted to say was, um, I, I wrote it with Elizabeth in the tune, but um, we, we decided that we should be saying Eleanor so that we could honor uh, Norina as well. And Eleanor, of course, was the name that Baba gave the two of them. So you'll hear that in the song. <clears throat> Mera lives in the world among us, yet only on his love is her heart focused. She only speaks of Mayer, she only speaks of Mayer. Switcheroo here. If they insist. <laughs> Thank you. 
That's a song called Rainbow, and I always think of Baba's flag when I play that song. <clears throat> <laughs> okay, this is now for the light-hearted part of the... Uh, you're playing the upright... Oh, blue the light-hearted, light-heart, more light-hearted part. Blue I don't know, light-hearted part of the, the list here. Okay. <clears throat> so, yeah, this is the blue bus sea shanty. Um, <laughs> this is a newer song. Um, it's done to the um, corner sea shanty, which you might recognize. So it's repetitive and you can sing along. Um, this is an homage to Elizabeth Patterson. She was one of the first designated drivers um, of the blue bus by Baba, along with Erich. Um, and she had um, good credentials for doing that. She was a World War I ambulance driver. Um, but the credentials she didn't have was getting up early in the morning, right? <laughs> so um, she could do everything else. She could do everything else, but that was bad. And so Money writes about this in the Joyous Path, and and you could tell that Money found it kind of funny that she really was so disoriented in the mornings. And she tells Money tells this one story about how uh, Elizabeth was just crying into her cup of hot black tea. She was so disoriented, and. Of course, Baba comes around and he's like, Elizabeth, you know, what's wrong? Because, of course, they're supposed to be cheerful. <laughs> and Elizabeth says, everything will be fine, Baba. Everything will be fine because she always was obeying Baba. She was able to obey Baba. Um, but then Baba made light of the situation by saying, you know, Elizabeth, I take everything from my disciples and I give them agita and I give them high blood pressure. And... Um, and Money says in the story, she says, and that's how Baba would lighten things up when they had gotten too serious. So um, it's a Cornish sea shanty. Um, you get to practice, um, when, if you sing it along, you get to practice saying um, the sentence that Baba would say, yes, Baba, uh, that, that Elizabeth would say, yes, Baba, dear. She would always do, do whatever Baba said and say, yes, Baba, dear. And we wanted to shout out to our Cornish Baba lover friends who will be watching this on YouTube because it's too late in the night there. Avril Rob. Avril Rob. Keith, Keith Norma. Norma <laughs> Keith Philip and Jan. Jan. <laughs> Hello Jan and Finbar. Oh yeah, Finn. Finn. <clears throat> and Ernie, who's sometimes oh, Ernie. informal. <laughs> of course. Ernie, aka Alfred. Okay. Enough of that. <laughs> Oh, what shall we do with the blue bus driver? What shall we do with the blue bus driver? What shall we do with the blue bus driver? Early in the morning, hey ho, and up she rises, hey ho, and up she rises, hey ho, and up she rises. Early in the morning, roll her out of bed, sit her up straight. Straight, roll her out of bed, make sure she's awake. Her lie in the morning. Hey ho, 
like that one. <laughs> okay. All right. And then this one, this next one, you're playing the, oh, you're change. playing the bass guitar. <clears throat> I didn't know that that's the upright bass and the other one is the bass guitar. <laughs> Melinda? Yes. You were probably too busy playing, but Rosalie was holding up a little blue bus as you were singing. Oh, oh <laughs> thank you. Here for it playing. is. Oh, wow. <laughs> that's that's sweet. Beautiful. And it's got the stuff loaded on. Oh my God, that's a Yeah. <laughs> the people are all crammed in there. <laughs> yeah, right, right. There, there. And there was a pink person in the front seat. <laughs> All right, this is this one is is a shout out to all of you who won the lottery and got to go down to or are going down to Myrtle Beach or are in Myrtle Beach. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tribute to Myrtle Beach. It's a tribute to the to the Mystery Man is this one's called <clears throat> Mystery Man. <laughs> one, two, three, going down to South Carolina. that song called again? Mystery Man. Mystery Man. Oh. All right, we have the very well-known Don't Worry, Be Happy by Bobby McFerrin. Coming up next, <clears throat> to send you off to dreamland. <laughs> Music. Hold on, hold almost, on. almost, almost sending you off to dreamland. Hold dream. on, hold on. Oh, okay. Wait, we've got a we've got a music uh, musical instrument change. Here comes the upright bass, my favorite. Although I like the other two.
happy In every life we have some trouble But when you worry you make it double Don't worry Be happy Don't worry, be happy now one encore song you're not done are you we have um we have one more yes one one last to just send you one off. just one you sure <laughs> we're gonna we gotta get up and go to work tomorrow Come okay. On. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh i have to just play the same instrument sorry I'm just putting it oh okay all right well <clears throat> yes we're not real musicians because if we were real, we could play all night, right? <laughs> you just playing. I mean, oh yeah, sure, we got another one. <laughs> this is a little tricky. This one. remember. Oops. Hang on, give me a second. Yeah, we have to go slow. Yep. So. All right, make sure you're in the. I know, I'm not in, in the scene. Scene. Yeah, I'm not in the scene. It's all right, Ten minutes of fame. Okay. Happy travels to you until we meet again. Happy trails to you. Keep smiling. Till 
we meet again. Happy trip now. Jay Baba, everybody. Jay Baba. <laughs> Thanks for coming. We really love it. <laughs> Jay Baba, come again soon, all right? We're going to okay. arrange for another one. All right, all right. Maybe in the spring or something, huh? <laughs> we'll be working until then. <laughs> all right. <laughs> nice to see everybody again. Jay Baba. Jay Baba. Bye. 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 You better make your, you better speak now before they're gone. Oh, Melinda and Duke, absolutely wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. It was great. It was so much fun. You're going to have a fantastic duo. We're going to finally switch oh, it to you. gallery so we can, we can see, see everybody. We can see everybody. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Oh, hey, here. Oh, there we are. Oh, good. It was wonderful. Fabulous. Thanks so much. Thanks. Raphael was a friend of mine, so it was really nice to, I could hear, I could hear him in oh, some right, of what yeah. you were playing. Yeah, I stole a lot of his riffs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he's happy. <laughs> I'm sure he's happy too. You know, Ward told me he wrote that song when I asked permission to sing it. He did tell you that he wrote it, right? Yeah. Yeah, he yeah says, I was just wondering if he actually wrote the lyrics because Ward yeah, Parks is also that. credited on the CD. Yeah. Yeah, he, he told me he wrote it. I asked for it, and um, he'd sung it at the abode, and then, and then I asked for it, and he's, and I said, where did that come from? Because I thought it might have been Bob or Jim or something. He said, oh, I wrote it. So Yeah, yeah. Ward Parks, is, Ward Parks is credited on the CD along with Raph, but I, so I don't know why, but maybe he wrote the lyrics. It's possible. Maybe they wrote it together, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another mystery. Well, thanks again for every, to everybody for coming. We really enjoyed yeah. coming. Yeah, that was so much fun. Jay Baba. Jay Baba. Jay Baba. Avatar, Meher Baba, KJ. Avatar, Meher Baba, KJ. Avatar, Meher Baba, KJ.